we rolling? Yes. We're rolling? All right, well, I've been doing a little bit more porting on this AV7. Noticed a couple things that uh, have been brought to my attention as well. And um, what I've concluded is I made this uh, transfer window bigger. I'm going to keep this webbing in there, but I made this wider. If you notice over on this side where the where the red marker's at, that's actually where gases are blasting the back side of that area once it's installed on the case. Um, yeah, if I, inst if I install the case half on there and match it up relatively close, right over here where this red mark is, there's about... There is about this much of that window getting hit with, with gases. So I'm going to remove that window, but then again, I'm going to keep this webbing. So we'll go from there, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to dremel this stuff out. Want to slowly work your way down in there and get close to your uh, mark, but don't try to take it all the way there straight off the get-go. We'll be cleaning this up with some files too, so. Something else I noticed on the other uh, on this other side was this bottom piece of webbing was a little bit crooked, so I straightened it up to the um, thinnest spot. Wound up making the whole thing about six millimeters thick. When I measured this side, it was already bigger than this side to begin with. So right now I'm just going to bring this down to six millimeters like that was like that is rather
and I'm going to throw my uh, caliber on there and see if I got relatively close to six millimeters. That's some real cheapies, but they'll they'll do the trick. I'm about 5.8, 5.9. This side over here, I've got 5.9. Oh, 5.8, 5.9. So yeah, we're right on the money. Now I'm just going to take my uh, file and clean this up really nice, chamfer these edges, sandpaper on it, come on the inside here, do the same thing with some sandpaper and uh, chamfer all the edges over. And now, when you install this, once again, I'm going to keep that webbing because that webbing is going to keep this this skirt from from deforming under under uh, when it gets hot. You know, you want that's pretty critical from what I've been explained, and I'm going to keep it for now. Now, when you put it in there, you can see that this whole area is wide open now, and I can also see a nice stream coming through the bottom of the uh, skirt there so that concludes my uh, case matching for the AV7 I'm actually gonna assemble my engine and that'll be another video soon to come